to the video on how to complete the PEG validation forms. First, one of our grants offices will go through how to complete the legal entity and financial identity forms, and then we will look at how to upload them onto the participant portal. Now we're going to look at the legal entity form. We have chosen to complete the public law body form because it is the one that applies to most schools and public organization. But please check your type of organization before choosing the form. First, you need to write your school legal name with no abbreviations. However, you can include abbreviations later on if you wish to do so in the relevant section. Then you will need to enter your school registration number, which can be found on a website called EduBase. Please check for regional equivalents. You will then write the number provided, such as the DFE number, which is seven digits long, followed by any further information about your organization. In regards to the VAT number, you can find this on the company's house website. If your organization does not have a VAT number, please write not applicable. Please note that you have to enter either your organization's generic email address or the legal representatives. The date should show when this form has been signed. We will need we need this form to be printed, signed and scanned again, as we cannot accept electronic signatures. Finally, please use your organization stamp or write not applicable if your organization does not have one. Identification. The information required to complete this form should be available from your organization bank and their documents. Please make sure to complete all sections throughout the form. You can see now on the screen an example of how to complete the form. For the IBAN, you, you will first have the country code, then the check number, the bank code, the sort code, and your account number. The account holder's data should be that of your organization. If you want to provide any comments or notes, please do so on the remark box. This section provided for the bank to stamp and sign the document will need to contain a wet signature and stamp. If you were not able to provide this, you will need to upload a bank statement to your PIC. The bank statement should show all the information above but you can redact all sensitive information. Signature of account holder can be that of the legal representative or a senior member of staff within the finance department. Their job title should be provided along with the signature. Please note that you will need to print, sign and scan this form again. You can now see on the screen um, the participant portal. As you can see, my schools are listed here with their PIC number. Uh, please note that you will only be able to see this screen if um, you access the participant portal using the email address that the PIC was registered under. No one else will have um, access to this screen. If you want to modify your organization, so for example, to upload the documents to the PIC, you'll need to click on actions and then on modify organization. This will then load a new tab on your browser, which as you can see is currently loading. And this tab will have all the information that was provided when the pig was registered. If there's any information that is wrong or has changed at any point, please um, amend it now. So for example, if your school has changed names, and then once you have checked all this information, please scroll all the way to the bottom where you will get to the document section. In order to upload the document, you, can, you will click on add document, choose a file, 
choose the relevant form. And then if it's a public law body, this will be the one that you will choose. And you will then mention on the description that this is the, for example, financial entity form. Once you have done so, you will click upload. It will take a few seconds, so please do not close or refresh your browser at this point. Just give it a couple of minutes so it can load. And as you can see, it will say that it's been received on this date and it will be the so this is it from us. Thank you very much for watching and please do let us know if you have any questions or, or you experience any issues. We'll be happy to help. Thank you.